Hello, today I'm going to show you how to use and to view a Java project. First thing first, I will create the Java project. I will use log4j to demo because I want to use some Java library. To save time, I've already created some sample code. So just copy over, just paint here so Eclipse will automatically create the code and then create the package. You need to import some library. You need to download log4j.jar. So I will create a save create folder for that. This one custom folder so you can name whatever you want. You want to add the library to the view part. You also want to create and file name log4j properties. Just under the project. Content. And then now I want to run it. Oh, I think my mistake. I need to copy over the property type property file under source folder. Now I try to run again. It should really work. Okay. Now I want to, this one we run using Eclipse, but you want to, to run as a, a standalone application. You need to build, and then now I will show you how to use and to build the project. First thing you need to show the end, so you show the window here, and you also need to create the file name build.xml. This name is also custom. You can name whatever and then you place under the project folder. Save it. Okay, now I will add a new file. This name is will display here. I can change it. This will be changed here. Okay, now I just expand it. And now you see two target, which is uh, declared here. The first one, just to delete the folder and then create an empty folder. Okay, I go and check it. It's empty now. Now I will run the second target. Oops. Okay, this one, this one uh, also a custom file and then you need to create. I just create a new folder. I name it config. Okay, now I will create a new file. To open it by text editor. Copy paste. I will explain this one later on. Now I run again. Okay, this works. Okay, now I'm gonna explain what's happened here. The clean method you can see. The command here is to delete the folder name view. This one is this folder. This one, this folder. And then it will create the directory name build. The second target here is the de depends. It means that before running this 
target, this will call this target to clean all the stuff. And then this is called the Java to compile all the, the Java to the classes, uh, all the sort code and the sort folder here. And this command is to copy all the lib folder. Lib folder is mean this folder. And in this com slides, you see we name, we will declare the name for all the folder. It means source, but you also can use the original one. This one is mean user thing that you declare here. Okay, come back to this one. Uh, this folder is to copy all the, folder, the file under library folder to the folder uh, under the view part. So uh, this command is similarly, but is not copy the folder, it's just copy a specific file to a folder, and this one we copy the log4j folder, and now we want to check what's coming. Okay, here, now you can run the file. Okay, it's too fast, right? So I will run my command line so you can easier to see. is here, right? This is what it works, and now I will explain for you this file. This one actually just run the Java to, to run the class file, the log4j class, which is uh, can look at it here. The Java demo is file. And then this one, we Sometimes we need to set up the Java memories in case it's run for long and then heavy load, so it can be out memory problem. And this one is to point out where the library, this is, should be under this folder, this, this here. And this one, you need to show the package name and then the class name. So that's it. Thanks for watching.